Good morning. Good morning. May I request everybody to be seated? Minister Toivaka, Excellencies, distinguished colleagues, guests from all around the world, friends of you and you wider, old and new. It's a great pleasure for all of the you and you wider staff, myself included, to wish you a warm welcome to the 30th anniversary conference of you and you wider. We tried to put together an exciting program, including a keynote by Professor Joe Stieglitz and the wider annual lecture to be delivered by Professor Amartya Sen. It's our sincere hope that the wider 30th will be a memorable event, focused on the largest issues in global development in the traditional wider way, with a lot of learning, frank dialogue, and collegiality. Some 600 people will participate in the conference, including participants from no less than 75 countries. And this wider anniversary brings 325 guests to Finland at a key point of time in global development and discussions. There are senior people coming to this conference who were with WIDER in its very earliest days. Indeed, it was Amartya Sen who came up with the acronym WIDER to focus our minds on the wider perspectives in development and to question orthodoxy. Many young people are also present. It is in WIDER's genes to help foster the talents of the rising generation of researchers, especially from the developing world. In preparing this conference, we've highlighted the importance of our profession to engage with the big questions in development, which policymakers face day in and day out. And there's a fine tradition in development economics of academics crossing back and forth between academic life and the policy world either in their national governments, or donor agencies, or international organizations. Hopefully, this conference will inspire the up-and-coming generation to get involved in policy and big issues as they think of their next academic publication. WIDA is every day working all over the world. We are a global network. At the same time, WIDA's had its main hub here in Helsinki for three decades. So Helsinki is the base to the core WIDA personnel who come from more than 25 countries. I would therefore like to express on this occasion our warmest gratitude to the Finnish government and the Finnish people for all of the hospitality and support extended to the staff and network members of WIDA over these many years. <laughs> Importantly, Finland championed 30 years ago the wider endowment fund, also fueled by Sweden, Japan, and India. A sincere vote of thanks goes as well to the current countries and institutions which support wider financially, including the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Finland, CEDA, DFID, Danida, the Government of South Africa, and COICA. It is on this background both a pleasure and a great privilege to introduce to you Her Excellency Lenita Toibaka, Minister for Foreign Trade and Development in Finland. We are grateful to you, Minister, for wishing on this day to convey a welcome message to the conference participants. Minister, may I request you to take the floor? Thank you. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and our dear guests from all around the world. I really wish you all warmly welcome to Helsinki and Finland. I hope you enjoy your stay here. And let me begin by congratulating you and you wider for its 30th anniversary. Uh, it was 1985, 
30 years ago when WIDER began its very important work here in Helsinki. Since then, thousands of researchers and policymakers have passed through its doors and have taken part in hundreds of WIDER events in all regions of the world. WIDER has an especially fine tradition of bringing senior researchers, including Nobel laureates, together with early career researchers, particularly from the develop developing world. That tradition continues with this conference. Over the next three days, you will participate in discussion on the biggest topics in global development today and in the future. Poverty, inequality, climate change, conflict, trade and finance, to name only few. This conference is appropriately titled Mapping the Future of Development Economics. As a policymaker, I'm very much interested in how research of that kind you do can contribute to helping make better policies. Research is like a good map, as we see here, in the way it can help guide governments and societies. WIDER is also very well named. WIDER has encouraged as wide a spectrum of views as possible. There is not one single model of successful development. Countries can achieve economic transformation, inclusive development, and environmentally sustainable societies using many very different institutions and policies. But success is led by countries themselves, their people and their governments. Many of you hold very important positions in your governments, universities and development organizations. Many of the young people here today will hold such positions in the future. The international community is helping governments and societies across the developing world, and Finland's support to wider helps good research in its mission to inform practical action and policy making. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very happy that more countries are now moving from low to middle income status. Africa's progress is very welcome. It's good to see so many African colleagues also here at this conference. We look forward to learning from your insights and experiences. Yet our work is not done. Ongoing climate change poses a serious threat that could undermine future development progress and indeed the future of humankind. This is why we in Nordic region are strongly committed to do our utmost best to, pr to promote environmentally sustainability and more generally the 2030 Sustainable Development Agenda. Social inclusion in which we believe strongly it's, it's not just about reducing absolute poverty. It's about reducing inequality as well, and this has been a constant theme on wider research now over 30 years. We cannot achieve true inclusion until we achieve gender equality for girls and women. This is both good economics and a basic human right, and actually one of the priorities of Finland's development policy. We are therefore pleased to see that WIDER has taken major new research initiative in this area. Finland also has a deep concern for peace and ending the suffering caused by conflicts. Today, conflict is undermining development and deepening poverty. It's good to remember that the United Nations was founded 70 years ago in the aftermath of a catastrophic war. Finland is a strong believer 
in the values of the United Nations. And as an institution of the United Nations University, WIDER celebrates now its 30 years as United Nations celebrates its 70 years. And the United Nations University its 40, 40 years birthday. And I think we need a strong United Nations now more than ever. Finland has been proud to host WIDER in its Helsinki home for 30 years now. This anniversary conference shows the value of international collaboration. There are people here from all over the world, including Asia, Africa and Latin America. And Europe, of course. We are here to learn from each other. Thank you, UNU wider and Finland welcomes you all. Have a nice seminar.